We're almost there. Uh, I have a car, Bacchus. No time. We would have been there months ago. My shows you from behind. Okay, wait, wait. Remind me again. Why are we going to Psychos? So he disappeared around the same time the DM did. They got to be linked. Are you using logic? After you made me hoof it for three months? I'm just saying, whatever got psycho must be linked to the DM, right? How could that be coincidence? You'd be a terrible lawyer. Okay. Yes. Yes. Yes! Alright, what do you think? Meh. What do you mean, meh? Stop playing with my avatar. You're trying too hard to make this perfect. Let's just do it. I have to present my best case in order for this to work. Do or do not. There is no try. Maybe if I were a genius, I could see what's missing, but not everyone's a genius, all right? I should have printed off my Google Maps before we left. You're right. Jeez. Speaking of which, you know what we want to talk about? How much you miss having killed in around? No, I do. Which problem is it? Goodwill hunting. It's... Turned 20 last year, and it's aged well despite the era that it came from. It shows what intelligence can do in an unconventional package quite well. I told you, I love Legally Blonde. Let's just talk about it. I don't know, something's still- Listen, for this love, according to Kelvin, Silo need to found himself, the neighbors would have complained about a smell. Can't fault that logic. So what are we doing here again? Just sniffing around. Hey, what's this? Hmm. Mm. Official. Been in hell this whole time. Hello. Hi. Found him. Oh no. How bad is the smell? Now he's right in here with the lady. Weird. Let me take a look. Hey, she's mine. How the heck did you get in there? Whatever you do, don't touch the panel. No. Don't invite him in. Why not? That's probably how he got trapped in there in the first place. Oh. Will she still be there? I. Um. I don't know. Better not risk it, Dan. Such a nice guy. Well, damn, I don't know what to do with him. Hmm. If only, only Will Hunting were here, he could figure this out. That, that was weird. weird. Jinx! Oh. You know, I never thought about it before, but there are similarities there. Okay, I think the DM has actually poisoned your brain a little bit at this point, because these movies have nothing in common. Wanna bet? That's it, go to Mon. And we've danced before, I've got this. Was it a waltz? There's no way you're winning this. Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Whose side are you on? Well, to be perfectly honest, I just want to watch the world burn. That's hot. Legally Blonde follows Elle Woods, sorority leader and all-around best influence on her sisters. She's got it all, including the perfect boyfriend who's for sure going to propose. Yeah, already no comparison. Here's where Will lives. And this is what he does with his friends. It's me, Will. Remember we went to kindergarten together? He couldn't find two people more different. He doesn't have much imagination, does he? Who's she? She's a puka. Did you forget when Elle went shopping and Will was at the bar? Hmm. What's a puka? Shh. The economic modalities, especially in the southern colonies, could most aptly be characterized as agrarian pre capital. All right, of course that's your Hang contention. On a You're a first year grad student. You just got finished reading some Moxian historian, Pete Garrison, probably. You're going to be convinced of that till next month when you get to James Lemon. Then you're going to be talking about how the economies of Virginia and Pennsylvania were entrepreneurial and capitalist way back in 1740. Hmm. Did you see this one? We just got it in yesterday. Oh, is this low viscosity rayon? Uh, yes, of course. With a half loop top stitching on the hem? Absolutely. It's one of a kind. Hmm. It's impossible to use a half loop top stitching on low viscosity rayon. It would snag the fabric. And you didn't just get it in. I saw it in the June Vogue a year ago. So if you're trying to sell it to me for full price, you picked the wrong girl. He is as sharp as cheddar cheese. And the only reason either reacted that way was someone was looking down on them. Like you, at us right now. Oh. Hey. Better? Nope. You're still not seeing it clearly. Really? Picture looks fine to me. Oh, the lens is clear. The film's just overexposed. Damn, I thought you were mean to me. So, you got film in your head? So we have one link, but that does not the same make. 
Legally Blonde, a comedy. Not as dumb as the title makes one believe, though. Goodwill Hunting, an award-winning drama that also happens to be hilarious. Why? Mini Drivers Joke at the Bar. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> that was good. Oh, man. Okay, I'll give you that one. That's why it was so well received. While Legally Blonde did stick to comedy party lines, Matt Damon's claim to fame mixed the highs and lows that life throws at us every day and turned it into a tight, strange little story. I'm actually surprised you picked this one, Socio. It has way more to do with psychology than your field. Hey, the social elements are strong too. Society judges his acting out and dismissal of norms as deviant, even though he only deviates because he believes he's smart enough to get away with it. It's a very house if he were a punk. Elle is no different. She's brilliant, but pretty. So she's not taken seriously, even when she's right. You know, I've been saying that about Kelvin for years, but no, everyone just says it, that he just talks funny. How so? No idea. It's a mystery. And unlike Will, she doesn't use her intelligence to alienate others. She tries to build them up. She doesn't sacrifice her morals or her integrity to get ahead while being a lawyer. That's ironclad Will defined. She sets her mind to something, and nothing gets in her way. Mm -mm. Ta! Another key difference. Will coasts. Like the smartest kid in class, he knows all the answers, so he doesn't have to try. And anything that pushes him to overcome some obstacle, usually emotionally, he thinks his way around or outright avoids. Objection! How is that any different from Elle? She only starts trying once she has motivation to get into Harvard because, get this, She's avoiding the emotional consequences of her breakup. Objection attained! He means sustained. I like his way better. Counterpoint! She embraces who she is at her core and never changes while Will has to overcome the psychological abuse he sustained. I'll, I'll give you that. <laughs> yes! But you just proved his point that your choice had way more psychology than anything else. No wonder he's smirking. Also, don't forget that both love interests help domains grow in important ways not only to their success, but better enjoyment of their lives. Oh, and there's also the bad mental character that both have to overcome in order to progress their plots. How do you pick up on that? Classic Disney princess formula. I pegged you for a Disney guy. Marry me. Today is so weird. <laughs> So ultimately, both are strong-willed, smart characters who make their own choices in life despite what the circumstances demand of them. All because they decide for themselves first and foremost and use their assets well. These movies are fraternal twins. <laughs> I see what you did there. I've never thought of it that way before. Thanks, Psycho. Wait! Yes? We're still stuck in here! Oh. Bacchus, do you have any ideas? We're doomed. Yay! Ooh, ooh, oh! If I got Kelvin here, he could do something to fix this whole thing. Excuse me. Vicia! Divi Vicia! Legos! What the heck's my phone, yo? Hey, it's gonna be a while before he gets back. He's trying to look for his phone in purgatory so he can call the silo. How? What did. How? Oh, Kelvin says as his psychic anchor. Means we connected across space and time. It comes in really handy. More weird. Psycho, that's it! What? Use your psychic anchor! Why, I don't have one! Your biggest limitation is yourself. And we're back to quotes. Think hard. Who is your other half? The tails to your heads, the back end of your horse. Hey, Socio. Yes? Go watch your favorite part of your favorite movie. Why? Why not? Makes a good point. He's easy to handle. Okay, you must have a plan. Just a hunch. Listen for it. What? Opportunity. That's an odd choice. How old school are you? Are, are you okay? Take my hand. Seriously, who are you? Do you want to get out of here or not? <laughs> Holy crap, it works! Where's your music go? Give me that! Gladly! Is you okay? Enchanté. Bless you. <gasps> and now he's dear. 
And so unsure. Hey, lady. Yo! This is the book that imprisoned us. Do you think it's flammable? Only one way to find out. Hey, I was getting to ring out! She'll be back. What'd I miss? Oh, well, I watched half Robocop, uh, Kelvin talked about Buffy, so she went crazy with Q-tips, and uh, DM's missing. Really? M my tormentor's gone? He couldn't get any better. He actually disappeared when you did, right around the time the storyteller showed up. Is he an improvement? Nah, he's like an evil version of the DM. Talks like a game show host. I can't believe I'm asking this right now, but where's the DM? Well, we see him sometimes. When? When we try to talk to him. Like, hey DM! Oh, and my friends! You got trouble! You got terrible pe Fifteen numbered balls and devils! See, that's all we get! I do see, he's right yep. there. Man, he's not actually roll. there, that's just dead. Yes, you got trouble! Right here in River City! Trouble in the capital T and that runs with P and that stands for pool! Turn on the journey's first pass this way like once! <laughs> what took you so long? I expect to be out of here like six episodes ago! Sorry, I just got- DM! I, I got to show you my bow, she's beautiful! I'll be here back! Wait, wait. Psycho, you tell me you did all this? Mm-hmm. <laughs> this... That's not a very funny... Calvin, you can come out now. This is, this is really not a funny joke. He's in purgatory looking for his phone. Well then, congratulations on being late. I'll give you 50 experience for it. You trapped me in a book for what feels like centuries, and all you have is congrats, here's XP? What? Your damned leather book DM? The one you sent to my door? Not funny. Ah! I see, I see. He, he, he had death send you the book, and that's how he got out. Clever bastard. Wait, 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 I, I was sure that was you. What? No! The last thing I sent you was the tape we can't talk about. You didn't make me review Manos, then. I... Psycho, I'm a DM. I'm not a monster. Um... I'm sorry I lashed out then. All is forgiven. Now, just, we need to find the storyteller and just put him back in the book and then everything went back to normal. Back into the, oh. Psycho, where is the book? Man, that took forever to burn, let me tell you. Thick old pages, man. Oh, who's your friend there? Hi. Huh? He looks pissed. Far beyond. Well, at least we all learned an important lesson today. And what is that? Legally Blonde and Goodwill Hunting are basically the same movie. What? Think about it. Hmm. Huh. Come on, let's go. <laughs> actually, you got a bit of a point there. There actually are. Ah, oh, there are quite a few similarities within two. And they both have stupid titles. Take this to the internet. See what the internet has to say about this. Huh. Huh. The social posted a video about comparing the two. I'll have to watch that. Come on, we're almost there! I attempt to intimidate them with a deep bellowing war cry. Right. Let's see how all their sleep goes. <laughs> oh, natural one. Oh, yeah. They piss themselves in terror. <laughs> Common reaction when voices of deep bazaars are yelling at you. Yes, yes, it's not something you easily get used to. I get used to it. I love it. <laughs>